You might be wonder how a normal video can be converted into amazing 3D anaglyph video, which actually works. You might have seen others tutorial promising to create 3D red cyan video from a normal video. I have seen a lot, but every tutorial failed to create that amazing 3D effects. Reason behind it is that they only change the channels to red and cyan, and they simply dislocate the layers and tell us this is the result we want. But this tutorial is something different. I'm going to teach you the best way of converting the normal video into 3D anaglyph which actually works. So without wasting more of your time, let me begin this tutorial. Drag and drop the normal video you want to convert in After Effects. Drop the video into Composition Panel. Now, double-click on the video. Make sure you are on the first frame of the video. Click on this icon. It is called Roto Brush Tool. If you unable to find this icon, then you need download latest version of After Effects. If you want to know more about Roto Brush, then click on the I button on the right top corner of this video. After selecting the Roto Brush, simply select the portion of the video which you feel it is near to you. In my case, the butterfly and flower is near to me, meaning that they need to be pop up when we wear our 3D glasses. As simple as that. After selecting, press spacebar. This will process the video. You need to check each and every frame to be clearly selected. This looks good to me. Once you're done, click freeze. Now click on our main composition layer. Your background color may be changed according to your preset. Make it black as it's give you best result you want. Now right click on the video and go to effects tab. Go to color correction and select exposure. Make offset to one. Again, go to effect. In blur and sharpness menu, select Gaussian blur. Make blurness anywhere between 50 to 100. This depends upon the video. For me, it's 80. Now you need to render this video. Let me quickly render this video. You can choose any video format. Rename it. I want to call it as Displace. Now hide or delete this video, as we don't need it anymore. Drag and drop the original video from the project panel to the composition tab. Duplicate the video. Right click on the top layer. Go to Effect and in Distort menu, select Displacement Map. Here we need to add a displacement map layer. This is the one we just rendered. So bring that video into After Effects. Drop it to the composition panel. Now you can select this video in displacement map layer. Change the horizontal displacement to anywhere between 10 to 30. Again, this will depends on the, your video. Play with it and see which number will give you amazing results. In my case, I choose 20. Make vertical displacement to zero. You can see how this displacement will work. This is the reason behind giving that amazing 3D effects. Now one last step is left out. That is making one layer fully red and another fully cyan. To do that, right click on the top layer. Go to effect. In channel menu, click on set channels. Now select the red channel as off and keeping all settings as it is. Now right click on the second layer. Effect. You see our last action is shown here. Easy isn't it? Select set channels. For this layer, you leave red channel as it is, making other channel off. You now see only cyan. But where is red? The red layer only seen when top layer is disabled. To see both the layers, it need to be blend. To do that, right click on the top video. Go to blending mode and select screen. That's it. Our 3D anaglyph video is ready. Use your 3D red cyan glasses to see the effects. Hope you find this video informative. If so, please do like this video and subscribe the channel. See you in the next video.